Hello friends, welcome to AngularJS video tutorials series. In the previous video tutorial, we understood what is AngularJS. In this video, we understand how to download AngularJS library and use it in our website. We understand how to download the AngularJS library and link to our HTML pages and use guides. So let's get started. I right click here, say new folder, name it as my-website. Consider I am creating a website. What I do first? I am going to create a root folder for it, right? So I created a root folder with the name my-website. Then I search for the notepad. I select the notepad. You can see that the notepad got open. Here I am going to write the basic structure of any HTML5 document guys. I say less than exclamation mark doc type HTML greater than. By reading this line of code, browsers understand the given HTML document is the HTML5 document. We know that our HTML document begins with the opening HTML tag and ends with the closing HTML tag. In the opening HTML tag, I say lang equal to en. Lang equal to en indicates language of this document is English. We know that our HTML document is divided into two sections, head section and body section. To indicate the head section, I say opening head tag and closing head tag. To indicate the body section, I say opening body tag and closing body tag. That's body section, that's head section. In the head section, I say meta char set equal to utf-8 greater than. This code indicates character set of this document is Unicode transformation format 8. Then I set the page title. I say here opening title tag and closing title tag. And here I say angular angular js demo. I am going to save this file file save as. I save the file inside my dash website folder with the name default.html. Both sides have put double quotations and save it. I minimize it. Here in my dash website folder we have default.html page created, I right click on it, say open with the Google Chrome. You can see default.html page is open in the Chrome, title is set to AngularJS demo. Now we are going to understand how to download the AngularJS library offline. I click on the plus sign, I search for Google, I go to Google and I search for AngularJS, I hit enter. First link AngularJS.org takes us to the AngularJS website guys. Then we have to click on download AngularJS button. Here it is telling you are going to download 1.8 latest version, the minified version, 1.8.2 version it is selling. If you want you can download the uncompressed version also. I want to download the minified version. So I leave the default settings here. If you want to download, you can even download the additional modules. We talk about the additional modules later guys. All you need is just click on the download button. When you click on the download button, it takes us to angular.min.js file where we have the minified version of the angular.js library guys. I say control A, control C to copy, copy the entire code and then I search for the notepad. I select the notepad and paste that entire code here. I am going to save this file, file, save as. In my dash website folder, I create one new folder. I say angular.js folder. I open it. Then I give the file name angular angular dot min dot js as it is a minified version i am giving min dot js i click on the save button i close it i close it you can see we have successfully downloaded the angular dot min dot javascript file guys next thing is we have to link the javascript file to our html document for that before closing the body tag we write opening script tag and closing script tag and then i say here src source angular angular js folder inside that we have angular angular dot min dot js file we are telling it to link this and then type equal to text or java script and then i save it file save so that is how we download the angular js library offline and link to our html page that is how we download the angular js library offline and use it in our website guys i suggest you people to try it yourself in the upcoming video tutorials, we are going to discuss more about AngularJS. If you like this video, hit the like button and share with your friends so that everyone will get benefited. For more benefits and be up to date, do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Keep learning, keep coding, keep sharing. Thank you guys. Thank you very much. See you in the next tutorial.